Howdy there. We're going to be doing a first impression on some makeup products. Because I felt like wearing makeup and I ended up buying some new makeup yesterday. So the two products I'm going to be doing a review on are both by Hard Candy. First is their Heavy Duty Concealer. Cheer. And this is supposed to be so good that it can even cover up tattoos. And I will read the back of this in a second because there are steps to covering up a tattoo. And I have already used both of these. I just felt like putting them back in the package to show you guys. The next is the Sheer Envy Eye Brightening Concealer. And I don't know how I feel about this one. Not how I feel about the Heavy Duty Concealer. At the end of this video, I will be popping a photo of before I put the concealer on, after I put the concealer on, before I put the eye concealer on, and after I put the eye concealer on. So you guys can kind of do your own little judging there. But anyways, this is the Heavy Duty Concealer with Concealer Pencil. And I did use the concealer pencil on my face. And it says, a heavy duty multi-use concealer that provides ultimate coverage, formula blends flawlessly into skin, hides everything from dark circles and blemishes to tattoos. And then, it says to hide tattoo, line the edges of your tattoo with a Glam Flodge Concealer Pencil, then fill in the area. Apply Glam Flodge Concealer over the entire tattoo and the surrounding area, pat dry, let concealer dry between layers. You may need multiple layers depending on the color of your tattoo. Okay, I've got some pretty big tattoos, you guys know that. Um, if you guys want to see me attempt this as a tattoo concealer, let me know below and I will try to do it. I will do it on one of my little dog paws. So that way we can have a comparison of what it looks before and after since I got four little dog paws. And yeah. But anyways, I actually liked this. I had, you can probably see because I scratched it and popped it, I woke up with a bunch of new marks on my face. Like a huge red bump there, like a blood clot or something, and then like I got some scabs right here and stuff. So I don't know what happened there. But it worked pretty well if you ask me. It, uh, it was a pretty light shade. Like it didn't perfectly match my skin tone. And I got the... What color shade did I get? I think I got ivory. Something like that. Can't find it. I'm pretty sure I got... Yeah. Ivory. Uh, ivory 1094. And I normally like my liquid foundation and my concealer to be a bit lighter. So when I put my powder foundation on, it's not overwhelming. I don't know. It's just my crazy logical thinking. But I like this. It actually seemed to cover pretty well. And obviously, when you look at it in the video, you'll still be able to see that bump. Because, you know, concealer, unless I keep globbing on a bunch of stuff, it's not going to make it look completely smooth. But there's other stuff you can use to do that. So I would rate this here probably a 9 out of 10 for a first impression if my views on this product changes. Anytime soon, I will let you guys know. I'm going to take it out. But so far, I like it. Now, it does seem like their pencil is lighter than the concealer itself. That's fine. And that's a little tube. But I really, I really like this. I do plan to keep it in its container for the duration of how long I keep it. So that way I can just keep the concealer pencil with it. So... In the makeup bag, I'm going to see if I can get my fiancé to do a video with me. The My Boyfriend Does My Makeup Challenge. And granted, I have lost a lot of my makeup and a lot of my beauty blenders. And, like, one of them was sitting right there last night, and it's, it's just gone. Now, on to this product. It's the eye brightener. And, uh, my first complaint about it is, so right here's the pencil. This part here you have to twist. I twisted it for a really long time before the product actually started to come out and it went on pretty decently and it matched my skin tone pretty well in fact this shade here is probably an ivory shade too uh, it's actually just 939 light is what it says is that what you say on here yeah so it's a light shade because I'm not I'm not a dark skinned person my fiance wants me to tan and I'm like no I'd rather do you know how much more makeup I'd have to buy so no, we're not doing that. I mean, it went on pretty good. 
it didn't feel like I had a lot gooped on there. I put this on after I put on my liquid foundation. I will say that. But I normally don't go up towards my eyes too much with my liquid foundation. I didn't at all this time just for this. So, I mean, I put some powder on it, but how does it look? I mean, I still have my lines there. And the thing it said it was supposed to do, 10 beauty benefits in one. Reduces puffiness, diffuses shadows, softens wrinkles, even skin tones, eliminates dark circles, Blurs lines, brightens, conceals, corrects, and lifts. It just felt like I put straight up liquid foundation on there. I still have my little lines through here that I get because, you know, I'm constantly tired no matter what. I'm not lazy. I don't just want to sleep all day. I'm just always tired. Like, there's times where I'm hyper, but I need stuff like this to keep me going because I get so tired. And even when drinking this, I'll still get tired and I'm like, I need some more. And I don't try to drink this stuff often. I don't constantly drink it. This is from last night. But, so, I was, I've been looking for something to help kind of hide those and I was really hoping this would work. I mean, I'd probably still use it because it does blend in really well and I can get closer up to the eyelash line with it than with my other concealer brush. But, I'm going to keep using it. Maybe over time it might start working a little bit more, but for a first impression on this, uh, not so sure. It's got its benefits, and it's got your, it's just benefits. Is that even a word? I don't know. But, I mean, I don't see how it could do all ten in one. If someone, if any of you guys have used it and it's done it more than one of these things, comment down below and let me know. Alright, bye guys.